Like there was loads of us, like loads of youth in our area. And obviously it's a deprived area, like everyone's like, in, we're all in council estates and stuff. We grew up and then we kind of grew up and formed like a gang when we was young. I like, it's we're from Gypsy Hill, but we just called our whole thing Gypsy. Where we came from the streets, so we're proud to say this is where we're from. We never, we never had no silver spoon. So I got into a gang from young, so there I was about seven. After a while, I just came accustomed to things like that, like people getting robbed, like it was normal. It started becoming normal, normal, you could become immune to it. It kind of, we just got older, and as we got older, we got more ignorant and more in it. You know what I mean? Just like how y'all was just walking us around y'all estate, whatever, you know what I mean? We walking through the hood, and you got kids showing up, you know what I mean? You got people who could be inspired by what you did for real. It's all it is is just a vicious cycle and cycle. And then that's when I, I was like, nah, man, there's no, you don't win. That like, there's no winning. Like all my friends are in jail, or my, my, my friends are dead. I always knew that I was like, I don't want to do this. Like this is not where, I, like in a few years, this is, I'm out of this. And then that music is the kind of thing that helped take take us out of this. NWA, inspirational man. It's like we've been through some things in our life, and then to see them go through it as well, it in just another makes you like... country or whatever, and they just made it through and become the yeah, legends that they are. are and like it's it just crazy. makes you think that yeah, that, that we're on a similar path. You know, everybody is straight out of somewhere when it comes to you know. With, with, with black people, a lot of the times, those who do make it out are a hero amongst the hopeless. So a lot of people will be involved in gangs and stuff and just not say nothing and just, like we're saying, yeah, we was involved in that, but we turned that around and we used it into something positive. So, because there's so much other people in gangs that probably think, I could never make it. A lot of people are connected to this. You know, a lot yeah. of people see this as, you know, they time of growing up, they nostalgia, and they just want to make sure it hit the right way. You know what I mean? Because, like, after people see this movie, they'll be like, damn, I might try to go be Ice Cube today. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you never know what might happen, you feel me? So, you yeah. gotta put on for your city. It's not an anti-cop movie. It's a it's an anti-bad cop movie. You right. know, if you, if you throw a rock, in a room full of dogs, the only one that should bark is the one who got hit. Now that I'm really looking at it, when you when you see it, the rap and the music is almost secondary. You know, yeah, it's, it's almost it's like back the yeah, icing yeah, on yeah, top. Like, story, like you know, it's, it's 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 all about the story. It's all yeah. about the men. You know, it's about he's not he's not Easy E. He Eric Wright. You right. know, I'm not Ice Cube. I'm O'Shea Jackson. So like. It's, it's all these things that make it bigger than music. And you know, that's something that, uh, that I'm glad is displayed that way. Fuck the Police is such a pivotal point in the movie, you know, that's the boiling point. I think as a group, that's their biggest song because, you know, everybody is straight out of somewhere, but I just feel like every place in the world has people in positions of power abusing that power. Right. So everybody can relate to that. They say it's perfect timing and, and like it's not planned. That's what I was about to say. I feel it's like the universe planned. took over on this situation. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You feel me? Because who could who could who could plan that? You know, we shooting a Detroit scene, go home, Ferguson on TV. You yeah, like, damn, you know. like for real, you know. And like, we, I, we just hope that it get to the, the point where we like. Remember when the police was crazy? You know what I mean? Like, you know, we, we just want to make it the past. You know what I mean? And we was just trying to make a good movie, just like they was probably trying to make a good song. You know what I mean? And it just explode because everybody's still feeling like that. Instead of you know. Back in the day, instead of, you know, vandalizing or getting a Molotov cocktail and blowing something up, N.W.A. took their they, they anger, their frustration and all that and used it in a creative way. And they changed the world. So with this film, you know, 
it's NWA represents nonviolent protest in its most powerful like effect. 